Praise the Lord, everyone. Brother Roop here. Yeah, I want to talk to you about why Christians die early or before their time. And, um, you know, there's really no good answer for that. You know, I've heard a lot of preachers give a lot of reasons which they don't know if that's true or not. <laughs> so um, I'm not going to do that here, you know. Um, some good Christians die young. Um, and that's part of God's plan, and we just don't understand God's plan. Our minds are too mo small. Um, good Christians go through struggles of disease and perish. Only God knows why. Yeah, I can't come out here and give you a bunch of nonsense and, and explanations and because you know, there is none. Uh, it's all part of God's plan. God knows what he's doing. We just have to trust in him, even though it may hurt. Even though we don't know why. We just have to trust that it's part of God's plan. You know, James and Peter were arrested at the same time, but James was executed. They cut his head off. Peter was released by God. God sent an angel to release Peter from jail, supernaturally. He didn't do that for James. Why is that? Well, Luke, in the book of Acts, doesn't give us a reason because God did not tell him the reason. We just have to trust that it's God's plan that's working out. And we have to trust his plan. That's not a message that people want to hear. I don't want to hear it. I wish everybody's healed. I wish Jesus healed everybody. You know. But he doesn't. But... Um, we just have to trust his plan um, and understand that, you know, death is not a permanent parting. It's just temporary. It's just temporary. We'll see that person again in glory. And then we'll spend eternity with them. So our parting here is temporary. Even though someone dies young uh, or not as old as they should be. Uh, it is temporary. Uh, that's when people are mourning. That's that's a little comfort. There might be greater comfort later. Um, a lot of people feel that you know God turns their back on them or punishes them and that's not true. God has a big plan for the world, for us. I don't understand my own plan. <laughs> I don't understand everybody else's plan. We're just human beings just aren't we don't have a big enough brain to understand God's plan. So we have to trust. We just have to trust that that's in the long run, that's the best route, the best thing um, for the one who died and for the one who's left behind. You know, it's not easy. It's not easy. And uh, I'm not going to come on here and say it is easy because it's not. You know, there's no um, good answer but to say we have to trust in God's plan and trust in God's workings and um, well that's my message today <laughs> and uh, I hope it's a comfort to somebody um, 
you have any comments, put them down in the comment section. Um, and we can discuss it. Well, thank you very much. God bless you.